first met, do you remember? <laughs> you were so shy, you wouldn't even look at me. You just stared straight ahead. I was anchoring, like, into the camera. We met in middle school. We stayed here way too long to finish some of these episodes. I've slept on this floor, I've eaten directly off of this floor, like, multiple times. This is a good floor. This is where we met, do you remember? No, it's not. Go talk to your girlfriend about the floor. Wow, they're still up here. All of them. How have the custodians not seen these? Maybe they have. I hope they don't take them down when we leave. I hope they don't take them down when we leave. Well, I think it's finally time to reveal the location of our studio. We changed on the way. There's a bathroom in my mailbox. Not live. This is Baker News. I'm Paige. I'm Aiden. I'm Tristan. And I'm Bianca. We did it. Seniors, you have until graduation to get any files off of your school account. Juniors, I've seen a lot of files you shouldn't have on your account. Today's the last day to turn in textbooks and materials. Of course, if you're watching this, it's too late. And if you needed an announcement to find out it's the last day of school, you probably haven't turned anything in yet, so I can't really help you, so good luck, I guess. We're here honoring this year's retirees. This is Mrs. Hollis. Hi, I'm Mrs. Hollis. I'm here with physics teacher, Mr. Murphy. And I'm with principal of remote instruction, Ms. Van Vinskoten. I'm here with Mrs. Foote, um, guidance counselor and retiree. Yay. What are your plans after retirement? I need to get a job. Well, our last day of work is on the June 25th, and the plan is right now on June 27th, I'm moving to Texas. I bought the, the cowboy boots, and I'm ready to go. How will you get your money? Robbery, money laundering, lemonade stand? Yeah, all, of, all of the above. Uh, probably all of the above. We have a lot of sketchy entrepreneurs in this school. <laughs> will you like ride horses when you're down there, like how Mr. Allen does? I probably will not ride horses. I would feel bad for the horses. So my wife and children, they might ride horses. I'll watch. So what has been your favorite memory here at Bacon? Oh, you can't miss that. There's so many. I, you know what? I would probably say um, probably pep rallies are my I know, I know. Pep rally! You know what? I've got all the pep rally stuff, right? Remember, like back there, there's like a. Yeah. Right? Oh, okay. Okay, remember yeah. this? Yeah. It's a pep rally? Yeah. It's a, it's a weapon. Now, this is the jacket that you wear on the day before Christmas Demo break. Day, yeah. Demo day. Along with, you know, the red pants and the red shirt and the red socks. But, you know. Would you say demo day is your favorite day ever? Pretty close. Close second or, or a tie with uh, physics day at Darien Lake, which we haven't gone for a few years, but uh, that's, they're close. Both of them are good. Was I good in orchestra? You were always good and so was your brother. You were wonderful. Who was better? Um, probably you. <laughs> is Bonnie short for Bonneth? No, it is not. Boniel? No, not Banyo. Bonathan? And not Bonathan and not Bonita. Bonnie. On your birth certificate, it's Bonnie? It is Bonnie. Yep. That's, I gotta say, that's pretty yeah. cool. So you're famously known for your basement, or at least you are for <laughs> senior council, <laughs> oh, no. that you have everything in your basement. Like, yeah, people maybe. There's no dead people in my basement, but there are alive. Things. You know what? 
because I, I like there's a lot of graduation gifts. I buy things and then I'm like, mm -hmm. so you care so much about the students here. Like why have you seen us, especially Ada? Why do I care about the students? Yeah, well, that's a good question. That one. Um, because I love it here. I love community. I love the people. I love seeing the kids in the hall. Um, I'm not. I will try not to cry. No, I just. I just. Is, the people make this a great place, and we are a great community. I'm good people. Oh. <laughs> My best friend, Mrs. Foot. Do you have anything to say before you are gone forever? Um, no, I've just enjoyed my 28 years here in Baldwinsville. The students, the staff, um, make it Baldwinsville a special place. So thank you, everyone. Thank you for your 23.4 years yes, here. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. And all of you two stars. So this has been my interview with retiree Mrs. Foote. Thank you. Thank you, Baker High School. And remember, life is good. Look for good. Yes, and good luck in your retirement. We know you need to relax, go to a beach, and just oh, yeah. for like like 10 right months. <laughs> like just 10 months, just relax. No, I can't do that. I, I, I can do it for a week. Not 10 a week. Okay, 10 days. 10 days. Yeah. Okay. Well, so. well, good luck, and we will miss you so much. Well, we wish you the best of luck down in Texas and with your retirement, and I hope you can find a beach down there and relax and ride a horse and have fun. Thank you and I will. All right, back to you guys in the studio. We met Mrs. Cartier as the Baker Librarian when Aiden and I joined the Genius Bar. That's where we learned how to film and edit. Soon, we used those skills to found Baker News, where Mrs. Cartier devoted so much of her time in the library's budget to. A year later, she gave us a class born out of her passion for film. She became so much more than what any student could ask for in a teacher. Of course, she couldn't do it alone, Mrs. Morgan. From bringing us together in the film club, to creating the film class community, to giving us endless support with Baker News, thank you. Mrs. Cartier has directly influenced each of our futures, the college majors and careers we're going into are in the film and TV industry, largely because of her passion that had fueled our own. Mrs. Cartier famously hates musicals, so naturally, to show our immense appreciation, we present a surprise parting thank you gift. The Baker Newsicle! My high school diploma next week Cap and gown are in the trunk I'm off to college, I'm leaving finally Well good for you, I guess you'll move on really easily I'm having extreme deja vu right now We're saying goodbye, we're gonna be late New opportunities we'll take Cause at Baker High, you gave us our own We forged a path from what you've shown We're saying goodbye, Baker News We're saying goodbye, happy goodbye Tesca. We ran all out of rhymes. Well, you've heard the intro, that's my voice on the track. I brought the show up from nothing, they never gave me a plaque. But I'm back, here to hijack, it's kind of dumb tack. To say it wasn't single-handed, Cardi had our back. So thanks. Well, this is it. Us three are the last of the first generation of Baker News. And that's Bianca. We're going out on a nice, clean 70 episodes over the past three years. We've laughed. Hopefully you have too. We've cried, we've thrown chairs, we've been injured by those thrown chairs, and we've learned so much along the way. Now we're passing the torch to these guys, and we will be judging every single episode that they make. And now you can't blame us for anything that happens on the show. Thank you, Mrs. Cartier, for giving us this crazy opportunity and working so hard to make it last. Thank you, Mrs. Morgan, for all your help, and thank you everybody who's watched, who's made an appearance, and who's supported us along the way. Have a great summer, and they'll see you next year. This has been Baker News on WBXL-TV. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching! watching.